that seems to be everything inside the box the packaging is okay it is good enough to protect the keyboard and all of the other stuffs i don't really have any complaints about that the keyboard came in with colorful extra keycaps i guess if you want to put some color on your keyboard you can really put this over here and yeah i got the gray variation they also have a black variation they both look pretty nice now the keycaps that came with the keyboard are pretty high quality i have no problems with them they are cherry profile keycaps and then for the switches these are apparently the xvx magnetic switches now here's a little sound test with the keycaps on Now I think the keyboard sounds pretty okay, pretty good for a plastic keyboard. They did put effort in making this keyboard sound pretty good as you can see. Now I already mentioned that the switches of this keyboard are the XVX magnetic switches. So they do have adjustable actuation points and the rapid trigger as well. For the polling rate, this does offer 8000 hertz polling rate so really really nice. And this keyboard is also hot swappable so you can go ahead and change the switches if you want. But okay, enough with the numbers and the specs, let's actually go ahead and test it out, see how it performs in game how it actually feels like and of course this keyboard also has RGB so let's go ahead and see that as well okay now something that I noticed that is very cool is the under of the keyboard it does have this layout or like a place for you to put the cable so it looks much nicer there it is and now if I want it to just be straight up very nice but if I want it to go to the left Look at that! That is so cool, bro. Okay, I just plugged it in, and here is the RGB. Very nice. I have no problems with them. Now, let's go ahead and install the software and see more of its features. So, I have the website over here, first link in the description. So, if we scroll down, I think I did see softwares over here. And yeah, here it is the XVX G75 download. English install that launch it okay the background is pretty some of you will definitely like it amazing background so okay let's see we got home over here whoa okay that is pretty cool you can change the functions of the keys over here you can make it mouse macro shortcut reset then advanced key over here now you can do a lot of different functions for each key you can do mod tap as well we've seen that a lot toggle key dks very nice you also have different profiles over here you can also import now we also have performance over here now this is going to be for the actuation point now if you do not turn on the dead zone it will limit you to five i don't know if this is millimeters but it will limit you to five and 35 as the lowest but if you want to go down lower you can go ahead and turn on that zone over here and that will get you the full range of motion now they do not recommend you to do that because it does risk of broken touch. Your key might accidentally get pressed or get released. So they do not recommend that. But I'm gonna go ahead and try it out on one. On the lowest it can go for the WASD and spacebar. Because I do want them to actuate very instantly. Let's see if that makes any problems. But okay, for the rest, I do not mind them being on the recommended settings on zero on the five setting over here which is also still pretty instant when I felt it. So by the way, you can select all over here. Yeah. So I'm gonna set pretty much the same settings for the whole keyboard, except for four, five, shift, Windows, WASD, and spacebar. So the rest can go to five and they can have quick reset. Okay. Now for the shift key and the four and five, I do want them to actuate very instantly. So I'm also gonna do them on one, but I do not want them to have quick trigger or rapid trigger okay so other than that make sure you save this we also have macros over here so you can set your macros very nice and then next we do have the light settings over here 
you do have a lot of effects you can choose from yeah i do like launching the best and we also have real-time lighting yeah this is for customization so if you want custom lighting if you want your custom design but yeah it's nice to have that option you can also have music so if you want it to follow the music and yeah you can also have system settings over here you can also calibrate okay let's actually calibrate this might make the response times much better because it might affect the actuation or the magnetic fields apparently so yeah there we go i pressed everything Ooh. That is a huge difference. That is so much better, bro. Oh, shoot. Yeah, you definitely have to recalibrate your, your keyboard, bro, after you get it. That feels like 0.1 millimeters. But yeah, that seems to be everything inside the software. Really simple. I like it. Very easy to understand. But now let's actually go ahead and play with this keyboard. I have closed the software and all of my settings saved. Very nice. Okay, let's go ahead and game with it. Okay, where are we You are the one. You are the one. Okay, I have it. I have it. Time to jump. Fake teleport. Now it's ready. Two v four makes us go. Oh yeah. Run to A. Run to A. Cutting through. Flashing out. Wait, what the? What the? Right down A. One enemy remaining. Oh three, 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 three. I'm back. It's you and me. Um, I don't think we can real. Oh, and... One I am on, I'm on. Uh, so far, Where, where, where's your wounds? One enemy remaining. Ooh, nice. After playing with the XVX G75, everything was smooth and amazing. From setting up the keyboard, downloading the software. Oh, and make sure you calibrate the keyboard because it really made the 0.1 millimeters or the lowest or the fastest actuation point really much more responsive so yeah make sure you calibrate it but yeah the performance was really amazing very instant and also the rapid trigger it also felt very instant letting it go made sure to let go of the key immediately typing with it also felt very nice with the switches they are not heavy at all i think they are the perfect actuation force for me at least i didn't really experience any issues everything worked perfectly it does function like a normal magnetic keyboard and that is a good thing especially considering its price it is a very budget keyboard compared to other magnetic keyboard prices so this is definitely very worth it keyboard you get what you pay for very responsive very amazing magnetic keyboard i would definitely recommend it especially if you're looking for a budget 75 percent magnetic keyboard that you're going to use for gaming and also maybe productivity it's really really good i will be putting this keyboard first link in the description and you can also use my discount code m-i-g-s-s for some discount in the whole store and by the way this keyboard is sent to me by xvx but that won't change my review of the keyboard it will be my honest opinion honest review like my every other videos but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i pray and hope this video helped you in some way don't forget to stay grateful and remember jesus loves you bye bye